do the next episode of of the, the fairy series called Cold Case. I did it for the console, as some people already know who have watched it on YouTube already, and who kind of watched it last night before I was done recording. So I just gotta make sure, making sure everything's working properly. Make sure my stuff is adjusted. I don't know how to get this to work on my. Hmm. Oh, come on. Sorry. I'm trying to figure out how to get to pop up on another another piece of equipment. He's already got it working on. Okay, the TV is good, so I'm back out of that for now. Because I can tell it's broadcasting because the camera light's on, so I really don't have to come in to the Twitch app on my Xbox every day when I do recordings. I'm gonna shut it off, free up my bandwidth a little bit, and then I gotta figure out. Why is it not popping up on the app? I guess I gotta come out and come back in, cause it's weird. There we go. There we go. I got it working now. All right, let's get let's get started. I'm already. Oh, I gotta make sure everything. Make sure there's no ooh, wrong way. I don't need no background noise for my. Cause now if people actually join, I can actually talk to them. Because doing it through my PC, I don't know who's on, if anybody's on, or anyone if anyone's talking to me, unless I have it open on an app somewhere. So actually, technically, I don't even need the video part of it. I just need the... I just need the chat portion. Oh, see, it's now it pops up on the main screen, so I'll just do the chat portion. So, turn... Yeah, sorry, I'm... Alright, there we go. Alright, let's get started. This one's going to be similar to, it's going to be almost exactly the same, but of course besides the temporal probe, that's the only difference this version's going to have. Oh, you know what? I'd rather watch it with the video. I'll have it on with the video. Captain Long, scan, Long Range Scans confirmed the ferry Ambassador's suspicions. It appears that there is a portion of the star chart hidden in the runes on the planet's surface. Something is interfering with the scans, though, so we can't pinpoint the location from here. An away team might be able to do surface scans in order to locate the star chart and retrieve it, but we will need to close transport. Need to. But we'll need to close to. Okay, that they completely messed that type up transporter range in order to beam down. We need to get in, to get close to, oh, uh, whatever. <laughs> Alright, let's move on. Let's see how many times the connection gets interrupted today. Oh, the music stopped. That doesn't happen very often. The music just all of a sudden just stopped. <laughs> I'm not like hearing any music. <laughs> all right, let's get this going. Okay, well, the temporal probe is not in this location, so it must be in one of the other two places, or three places I have to go during this entire mission. Right, let's get into the proper setup. I'm actually starting to get the hang of using it this way. I used to be able to just do it like without doing it. Sir, I've just received update data from the ship's computer. Apparently this site closely resembles preserver site in the 
Began system, wherever that's at. The indigenous people there were able to access the site by performing a ritual. Records indicate that three people arranged themselves on pin plinths, forming arrows to point east, then south, then southeast. That's all the data I have, sir, but we may find it applicable to the site as well, to this site as well. Yes, I already know how to do that. But I gotta figure out where this I gotta figure out where east is again. Come on, oh, these stairs are so big you can't even climb up them. Alright, so I gotta get I gotta stand in the center because that's Oh my gosh, see, already we're already getting some jumping around. Alright, so I'm guessing that's probably east. Well, that's more like southeast. Oh yeah, see, this one I'm going to have to take myself out of that mode because. Alright, this one. It's a little bit different and easier, I think, to move your... Oh, that's not right. That's not right. Okay. Right. Come on, move over here. I need to get you on the deal. It's a little more tricky to get them on the... Oh, oh my God. It's... Seriously? Come on now. It's so much easier to get them where I want them. I have to like put it like right over here just to get them to get on. Oh gosh darn it. Shoal, you're in the way. Alright. No, I don't want to crouch. Get over here. Move out of the way so I can actually see what I'm doing. And you need to come over here. All right, now I can move Gora back. All right, that's one. All right, Ayami, we're gonna move you. All right, that's probably not right. Okay, that one worked, all right. Work, Captain. There are power, flu power, flu power fluctuations in the base of the structure. Only two more configurations until we are granted access. Okay, what was the next one? Oh, come on, there we go. Okay, okay, south. Okay, so this is facing east. So east is to my right. So south would be behind me. So, Goret, move your little, move yourself over to this side. Seriously, you can get on there a little bit better. need you to go. Seriously? <laughs> Alright, let's move you way out there then. Oh, and then you go across it. I need you to come. I need you to be right there. Okay. Seriously, you still didn't get on it? Oh my god, how far edge to the edge do I need to put this thing just to get you to get on it? There we go.
Something's definitely working. Yay, structure beneath one more configuration should unlock the structure. Okay, so south is pointing towards me. So this would be north. East would be to my right. So, oh, okay, there we go. Okay, you're fine. Ayami, move you over here. Come on, get on the stupid thing. There we go. And then De Rachau. Put you right there. I don't know which one it is. Guess the top. Nope, that's the one to the right. Long one, because that one's the one on my right. Five's on my left. There we go. Three is what I want. All right, we've done it, Captain. Sensors structure reconfiguring itself internally. It appears to be generating a holographic display matrix. You can record the data to your tricorder later for later processing, sir. But I think we found the first portion of the preserver star chart. All right, scan the piece. Yeah, I probably won't get any viewers on this because it's not through my Xbox like when I do the console one. All right, beam up. Now we get to go to the next location. Yay! Hopefully, one of those next one of those locations is going to have the piece I'm looking for. Yeah, I still I need to upgrade my uniform. <laughs> I haven't updated it since I became a rear admiral. All There's a Breen attack force converging on our position, Captain. They must have realized that we would be coming here for part of the star chart, sir. I'll bet they waited for us to do the work so they could swoop in and steal our data. There's no room to make a run for it. We're going to have to fight our way out. Sasha, you stay out of that litter box. Sorry, my dog was going into the cat into the bathroom where the cat's poop, where my cat goes to the bathroom. That's the last one, sir. Debris, trust the sensors, happier once we're out of the area and back in open space. Alright, now we get to go to Shinga! The Shinga system, oops, oh well. I'm so used to my console just automatically picking things up. Gotta love my rubber banding, but that's because my, as I've mentioned in all my other videos, just for some reason my network just randomly disconnects. 
from the modem on my laptop and it just bugs me. Only when I'm on a direct connection. If I'm on Wi-Fi, I don't see, I don't have the problem. When I'm wirelessly connected, but when I have a direct connection, it just, it bugs me. I'm almost tempted just to leave my Wi-Fi on and see if it li minimizes the effect that I notice. Keeping the Wi-Fi and a direct connect, then when it does this little drops the signal, it would still be connected. Who knows? Continue preserve for posterity, huh? That was the name of that. All right. Anomaly, or Captain Anomaly, or Spectacular Anomaly on the far side of the planet. The line of navigation beacons should lead us to it. Okay. All right. No probe here yet. Oh, I think I might know where it's going to be. It's probably going to be on that that last when we get the last piece. That's probably where it's going to be. Looks like so. What almost guy like blew up something? All right. Okay. Why is it? Oh, I have to be within three kilometers in order for it to actually do anything. All right, I'm here. Why aren't you doing anything yet? There we go. Yes, yeah, so you gotta be within three kilometers. Gaseous containment chamber, sir. Appears with no record of anything in this molecular structure on record. Might be synthetic compound or a byproduct of some sort of as yet unknown stellar phenomenon. Our science staff is working on to complete the analysis. Got something to preserve known to encode data in the world around them. So, so I superimpose the molecular structure of the gas sample onto the orbital pattern of the system. It's a map, sir, and it's pointing to something beneath the surface of that small moon. Recommend we approach and perform a level one submolecular scan to determine if there's anything of note there. So now I gotta go all the way over there. Oh, I was gonna say, where'd my chat window go? It's not a very hot looking star out there. Alright, there's the moon. I'm thinking it's talking about those. This is incredible. The interior of the moon is hollow and it contains vast geological orrery that charts the heliocentric motions or heliocentric motions of everything in this solar system. The orrery suggests that there should be two large asteroids in the area, but I'm only reading one. Perhaps they collided in the millennia since the structure was created. I am, however, re reading energy sources on the remaining asteroid, but it's buried deep in the rubble on the surface if there was a collision it, it is logical to assume that the rubble is all that remains of the second asteroid we will need to remove the rubble to get a better reading on the energy source now we whip it around Oop, I turn off the and it's starting to yeah yay we're rubber banding Now I gotta get into firing range. This I can actually get within 10 kilometers. What? I'm 
Seriously, I'm not close enough yet. Okay, why is it not? Um, why are you not firing? This close speed on the other way. Yeah, that's the Kelvin phaser bank that you're hearing right there. From the from the Kelvin timeline Federation starship. Alright, now we scan scan the chart. Alright, computer has synthesized a new star chart from the two fragmentary scans, Captain. Preliminary analysis indicates that whoever created these charts placed great significance on an L-class planet in the Manek system. Course plotted and standing by to engage on your command, sir. Alright, moving on to the next. Ship had some crazy weird graphical effect shining on the hole. Probably from the from that map. Alright, now we go back down here. Love the rubber band. I think there's only two episodes left. This one and one more for this series, and then we then we get to possibly I think go to the Borg one next because I have to do the Borg one before I can even start doing anything that do has to do with the Dyson Sphere and the Iconians and all the other fun wonderful mission sets that are still to come. Continue the missing on Manek. Come on. Come on. Yeah, I think this is like one of the shorter story arcs in this game. I mean, the longest ones are when we start hitting up the Delta Quadrant. That's where the. Because it's like one mission has got three or four different systems you have to go visit. Captain, I'm de detecting a Breen squadron dead ahead, but they're moving away from us at full impulse. They must have already f have what they came for, or else they would have engaged us directly. The Breen aren't afraid of a fight. We can't let them get away with the piece of the star chart. They could beat us to the archive. We'll have to chase them down. Yeah, I can see the Romulan said something a little bit different. At least that's one thing they got got to work properly in this game is they kind of split the story a little bit make it sound a little bit different between each of the the factions that you can play and granted the Romans are the only ones that can like either go I could have either gone 
with the Klingons, or I could have gone with the Federation, but of course I chose the Federation. These little, these little frigates are actually pretty rough, but I, I got one for one of my main characters. They're actually pretty decent little ships. Alright, still no probe information popping up yet. Sir, we have intercepted transmission from one of the Breen ships. The message was unsecure. They must not have had time to encrypt it during the firefight. The message contains a fragment of the star chart. They must have received that they must have received from the planet below or before we arrived. For all we know, Breen ships could already be en route to the archive. I will begin analysis to determine our next location immediately. Alright, moving on to the next one. Last planet, back to Reve. But we're going to Reve 2 this time. The binary stars of the Reve system. I'm surprised how many stars. Oh, I guess, well, I guess in if you've been seeing any of the TV shows, Ryza has three stars or three suns. Oh, whoa, oh, oh. whoa! Slow down. Oh, there we go. Race the race to Reve two. Hopefully, this one's got the probe in it. I have yet to come across any of the thing that says that the probe's here. So I'm assuming it's going to be here because it says there is one. Come on. Oh, there we go. Alright. Scanners are picking evidence running skirmish of a running skirmish on the surface of the planet, sir. It appears that the Breen are attacking an archaeological dig site. We'd better get down there as soon as possible if we if we don't if we don't want the Breen to escape with another piece of the star chart. Alright, well that's still no I gotta double check that. This sh it should be here. Yeah, see cold storage is the last part of this. Cold case. And that's where the Borg one starts. So there is one. I just haven't seen the notification pop up that there is one yet. Uh, this is the last destination, so it better be down here somewhere. Oh, I gotta get close enough to the planet before I can beam down. Uh, which one is it? Is it that one? Or is it? Because this one looks more like more ice than anything. if I knew which planet it was. I don't think it's this one. Yeah, that's too beat up to be even a habitable planet, so it's got to be this one. just looks really snowy. Not much green vegetation. There we go. All right. I just had to get closer. All right, guys. Let's, let's go get this last piece.
Captain, take a look at these scans. The frozen rock face near the center of the crater shows signs of a hollow interior, and these readings are consistent with preserver power sources. There are multiple Breen's life signs in the area, sir, and they are moving in a search pattern. They haven't found it yet, but it won't be safe to approach the site until we've subdued all guards. Alright, now there's a probe. The question is where? Let's see if it shows up on the map. I don't see any little white dots yet. Right, let's go deal with this. Where are you guys? Right, let's, let's go chase after this outer patrol first. Gosh dang it. <laughs> Stupid network. <laughs> or connection. It's not really a network thing. My network is fine. Just my connection to it is where it's having issues. Oh, there we go. I found it. <laughs> Saw the little white dot on my map, and there she is. <laughs> At least they actually show up on your map. That's one good thing. Uh, according to this, it says I'm already here, but I'm not even close. Yes, I know. I see it. I can see it. I can see it, Shosh, or whatever your name is. See, Hall, I can see it. It's right in front of my face. Unlock. Let's see. What are the Nakul doing here? Oh, I gotta calculate something. Okay, seven. Let's go eight. Six and nine. Eight. And seven. Alright, some sort of data collection in the cool here, letting the Breen do all the work. They're quite an usual piece. Oh, they're interested about the preservers too. They better hope the Breen don't find out their, what they're up to. I suspect the response would be rather cold. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I guess there's a little bit of the humor in that. Oh, come on. Come on. Alright, there we go. Oh, it's just, just gives me an item. A R and D item, of course. Now we gotta go chase down this patrol again, cause so there's the structure. Okay, there we are. Oh, there, that's those guys. Uh, the patrol is over there. Okay, that's one of them. And there's one more group that's run walking around. Hi guys. Oh crap, I forgot I still have the winter event weapons still on. Ooh, purple. I don't see that very often. Ooh, nice. Got some armor. And I could get myself some R&D, of course. The other patrol, we'll probably run into them if we come back this way. Because they're up on the ridge. They're over there. So we'll go take care of this guy. Group coming up over here. Because we'll take care of this outer patrol first. Hi, guys. Surprised you can't have, didn't come running when you saw us beam down. I could have picked up the minor ones because I don't have much of those. Alright, guys. You guys found it. You just can't figure out how you're going to get in it.
screen have been been contained. All right, now we get to. Of course. Oh, come on. That was quick. <laughs> yeah, we got a little another switch thingy here, but I don't have to do that. I don't, at least I don't have to do that this time. So all I gotta do is scan this thing or activate it. And then we get a surprise attack by another one of Terrell's lackeys. No, no, hey. Oh, that was Terrell. He came, he actually beamed down and actually got the fragment from us. Okay. I'd like to personally thank you for finding the Star Trek fragment. We're going to ultimately prove useful. Perhaps consider sparing your life. Of course, I'd have only spared it up to this point. Anyway point anyway so things would have ended the same either way still considering all you've done to aid the Breen on their final goal I might consider letting you and your officers live why not just beam back to your ship and run back to your federation like a good Starfleet lapdog see it says something about the shadows with the with the Rom with the Romulan character if you wish to fall today however I am happy to help you why don't you think it over and give your answer to Thought Par, which is the one I get to fight next, because he doesn't want to fight me yet. He's he's being a he's being a chicken. He's been dying to meet you ever since the defeat of Thought Grand. Yeah, of course he is. I hate that weapon. Comes in handy sometime. Alright. Let me go outside and be probably a little bit easier. Oh wow, I'm the only one still alive. Die. Of course, he finally gets me. I almost had him too. I almost could have done it on my own. All right, come on, guys, let's go finish this off. Let's get this over with. You'd think they would have put on some heavy coats before they came here. Holy cow! Jesus, he just took us all out in one shot. Holy cow. Wow. Um. Oh no, now my weapon's going wacky. I'm not even firing! <laughs> I don't know what the heck's going on. My weapon's firing on its own. Somehow I managed to get it to auto-fire. I don't know how. Alright, maybe I'll be able to take him out quicker this time. It's kinda nice, I don't have to fire my weapon. It's firing on its own. Whew. I almost got... I almost got canned that time. Alright. I don't know why it's doing that. I can't figure out how to stop it. Okay, finally it stops. Of course, the connections. Alright, let's assemble it. Yay, scanning transmissions are complete, Captain. I believe we found the preserver archive with the information we have, sir. 
and with luck we'll get there before the Breen do. Standing by to beam up the away beam the away team up on your command. Yeah, that's what I meant. Uh, I show you guys the way to Wonderland thing for this version too, but unfortunately I've already done my dailies. I can't do my dailies till later. Cold case, excellent work, Admiral. Stellar cartography teams are looking at the star charts you recovered as we speak. It might take some time to completely compensate for stellar shift, but if we can pinpoint a location, I am confident that my government will authorize an expedition to find the preserver archive. All things in balance and all things in time. Yay. Collect reward. Congratulations, Admiral. Oh, yay, I'm promoted to Admiral, Admiral, so I guess I can go do that stuff, I guess. Congratulations, Admiral, you have conquered yet another milestone in your journey through Starfleet. You still have challenges ahead of you, but I am confident that you will be able to do anything you set out to do. Good luck. Thank you, Admiral. Alright, let's go get my promotion. It's not really a ship I'm going to want, though. I don't like the Chimera very well. I like this one better, but I'm currently flying. Unfortunately, I can't get a better version of it, though. Because I can't afford to right now. Been promoted to Admiral. I'm a four-star now. Woohoo! Five more levels go, and I'll be Fleet Admiral. Oh, I'm already getting the next mission. Our scientists have consulted with your command commanders and concur with your crew's theory. If there is an intact preserver library, it is likely to be located on the Linas system. I suggest that you begin your search on Linas 3. It has a climate very similar to the Ferret. If the preserver settled here eons ago, it is possible that they would have chosen a similar world for this facility. Please be safe, but be quick. Long-range sensors have detected green vessels in the space near the Lanas system. I fear that they have made the same conclusions we have. You must find preserver technology before they do. Find the preserver technology before it. I don't know what I'm going to want. I'll, I'm probably going to go with this because I can get the whole set because if I do get that, that special winter prize ship before the 12th of January I'm gonna my this guy will have another ship to play around with that one's actually built like a cruiser because it's got a forward 4-4 four four and 4 aft I think I mean the the other one the one that they had I think a couple years ago a smaller version of the one that they're giving out this year it's only a three it only has a three forward weapons I think I have one because some of my other main characters. I have almost all the ships on one of my main characters, the Breen ships that they've been given out. All I need is that little fighter, that little frigate, and then I can get that last piece for the the console part of it. Consoles you put stuff on to improve your abilities on your ships. Whatever. All right, let's go. Let's go get my promotion stuff done. Scavenger, oh, scavenger hunt. That's what the next. Oh, I guess I got a new officer. What happened to the promotion information? Hail Starfleet. Yes. I don't know who I want. See, that's the one thing that the console version doesn't do. It doesn't give you. A well, I've maxed out all my slots anyway, so. But I think I get two more. Sl I get two more bridge officer slots when I reach the next, the next and final rank. I don't know what I need. 
One, two, three, four tacticals. We got one, two, three, four engineers. One, two, three, four science. So I guess I'll be going tactical again. It's an Andorian tactical officer this time. Oh, come on, Yankee. Now I have no slots to put you in, anyways. Available. Anything else available? I thought it gave me a pr promotion. I guess I must have already taken care of the mission. Alrighty. Well, I guess I don't need to. Didn't need to come here. Because I think I've already gathered everything I can gather. Oh, yep. Better. Claim my re my my reward. Uh, of course, I got crap in here that filled up all my slots. Yeah, I don't need that. I need to put some stuff in storage, it looks like. Or the bank. Okay, what am I giving that to? I don't even know what ship... I don't even know what ship I'm giving those to. Did I not collect the first piece? I thought I collected the first piece, but I don't know where I put it. I guess I'll figure that out later. Alright. Well, I've done all I could do for this episode, and hope you guys enjoyed. Please, if I like, comment, subscribe when I get this posted to YouTube. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Till next time, later.